understanding plastic pollution and how we can reduce it. Plastic pollution has become one of the most urgent environmental challenges of our time. Every year, billions of tons of plastic waste end up in our landfills, oceans, and even our bodies. But what exactly is plastic pollution? And how can we work together to reduce it? Definition of Plastic Pollution Plastic pollution is the buildup of plastic objects and particles, things like bottles, bags, and even microplastics, in our environment. Because plastic doesn't break down easily, it can remain in landfills and natural habitats for hundreds of years. How plastic ends up in the environment Plastics often enter the environment because of improper disposal, littering, and weak waste management systems. Lightweight items like plastic bags and packaging can be carried by wind or water, eventually making their way into rivers and oceans. The impact on wildlife and ecosystems. Many animals mistake plastic for food or become trapped in it. Over time, large plastic pieces break down into microplastics, tiny particles that can be ingested by fish, birds, and other wildlife. This not only harms ecosystems, but also affects humans when contaminated animals enter our food chain. The consequences for humans' plastic pollution has spread to every corner of our planet, from deep ocean trenches to mountain peaks. And now, scientists are finding microplastics in human blood, lungs, and organs. While research is still ongoing, the potential health risks are deeply concerning. How to reduce plastic pollution. Individual actions. Here's how you can help reduce plastic pollution. Starting today, reduce single-use plastics. Whenever possible, bring your own reusable bottle, coffee cup, or shopping bag to cut down on disposable plastics. Recycle. Properly, make sure you're recycling the right materials according to your local guidelines. Even a small mistake can make an entire batch of recycling unusable. Dispose of trash responsibly. Always throw your trash in the right bins and consider joining community cleanup events. Every little effort helps prevent plastic from ending up in our waterways and oceans. Buy in bulk and choose eco-friendly packaging. Whenever possible, shop at stores that offer bulk options or choose products with minimal or biodegradable packaging. How to reduce plastic pollution, systemic changes. But individual action is only one part of the solution. To truly tackle plastic pollution, we need bigger changes, improved waste management. Governments and industries must invest in better recycling facilities and landfill systems. Policies and regulations, laws banning single-use plastics or taxing plastic bags can make a significant impact. Corporate responsibility. Businesses can switch to sustainable packaging, use recycled materials, and adopt a circular economy where products are reused instead of thrown away. Hope for the future. Despite the challenges, there's hope. Across the world, people are coming together to tackle plastic pollution. From cleanup campaigns to innovations like biodegradable packaging, and plastic eating enzymes, change is happening. A plastic free future is possible, but it depends on all of us taking action. Plastic pollution is a serious issue, but together we can make a difference. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. Let's spread awareness and take action together. Tell us in the comments. What's one change you're making to reduce plastic pollution? We'd love to hear your ideas. And if you want to learn more about sustainability and protecting our planet, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Thanks for watching. And remember, every small action adds up to a big impact. Let's fight plastic pollution together. Reduce, reuse, 
recycle, every action counts.